Hello everybody, and welcome to a very special unboxing, a very Christmassy unboxing of a Biffy Boppy box. So, if you don't know what a Biffy Boppy box is, it's just a whole bunch of Disney stuff that someone chooses for you, pay a certain price for it. So, let's just hop on in and take a look at it because this is going to be quite a good one. I have a feeling. I have a good feeling. Let's see if that feeling is correct though. Okay, let's hop on in. So the first thing I am actually very excited about is they finally put a wrapping around this so the box doesn't get destroyed like it usually does. Um, every time we get a box, it's just like shredded or whatnot or ripped apart. But look how nice this looks. Here, let's try and take it out of the wrapping so that we can actually see how nice it looks. There you go, wrapping on that. See, look, look how nice that looks. Now you can see like every single little detail on that. That's so nice because who doesn't love a good box? So, first thing first, let's pop it open. Ah, we got a Christmas card. Guys, a Christmas card. Ooh, we're gonna put that to the side, but that is cute. But that's the whole what's inside the box, so we don't wanna get spoiled yet. But, a Christmas card. Look how freaking cute that is. That is so cute. Let's see what it says. She knows if you've been scary or nice. Happy holiday season from the team here at Biffy Boppy Box. Amanda, Becky, and Brenda. Well, I appreciate you guys. You guys always make nice boxes for us. See what, continue with the festive. This is, you know, the color. So let's just hop on in. Ah, yes. Everyone's favorite gift, confetti. It's the gift that keeps on giving. Oh, there is a lot of confetti. Let's see if I can figure out how to do this without making, oh, there's a little bit of a mess. So, starting off, we got a big item. Like, and there's smells coming from this? But, big item to start off with, which is super cute. Let's turn and look. Oh, I always just dropped all that confetti. We're there and put the confetti back. There we go. Okay, first item. Look how cute. It's a lounge fly bag. That is amazing looking. Like, it's Mickey. Like, playing crazy Mickey. It's so cute. Like, ah, oh, I don't know. Like, it's just perfect. Very nice looking. It smells like apple. Weird. But, let's go on in. Oh, that's really cute, you even think you can tell. That's a cute detail on there is, you can even see how to fly right down there. I don't know if that's focusing at all. There we go. How to fly, that's super cute. So let's hop on in and see what's inside of this. I wanna see what the print looks like. So, oh, well that's a pleasant surprise. There is a candle in there. Let's take a look and see what type of handle that is. No plastic. There we go. Ooh, it's kind of spooky looking. Let's see if I can get that going there. Like trying to do the beauty guru look on that. Let's see. There we go. Look how cute that is. And let's see. So, Malevin Apple. So, that's what the apple smell was. That makes so much more sense. So, Malevolent Apple, very fun looking and very cute. Almost Halloween, I would say. So not feeling too Christmassy with that, but Halloween enough. So let's take a smell. Oh, and it's the Wishes Candle Company, so that's good to know. Ooh, that is a lot of glitter. So, that's what we're getting when we first open. Strong Apple. Yeah, that's very Apple. I don't. It literally smells like you go to an apple patch right there. But look how pretty that is, like, gorgeous. Very pretty though. Like, I wish I could make you guys smell it, but we're just not there yet in technology. But it smells fantastic. I'm really interested to see how that one like burns when it, like, because you know how everything kind of smells different when it burns? I am wondering how that smells. It can smell like really good. Is there anything else in the bag? 
But anyway, going back, here's the print inside. Let's see if I can figure that out. There's the print inside, so it's actually the plane. It's really cute. I think the rest inside is just packaging. Yep, just packaging for the rest. But that is super cute. Awesome one. Fantastic. I'm excited to see what else is in the bag, actually. Box. We had, that was just our first item, and it had a secret item inside. So, back to the box. Go through all this confetti. Let's see. Ooh, okay. We got a pin. So I'll take it out of the packaging just so you guys can see it better. I feel like there's a theme here. A Mickey Mouse theme, per se. Look how cute that pin is. It's like that old school Masketeer look. Did someone watch our most recent Halloween vlogs when we were at the parks? Because guess what we were? We were Masketeers. So that's awesome. I wish I had that pin for that. That's awesome. I love the look of that. Still on the Masketeer theme too. So I'm taking stuff out of the bags just so you guys can see it better. That's really fun. So this is a little keychain right here. I'm trying to see if you guys can catch that. There you go. So there is our little keychain. It's a Masketeer hat. Look how cute that is. And it's embroidered. And bare. Oh, what's it? Bejeweled. That's the word. Bejeweled. But look how cute that is. And it doesn't have anything on the back of it, but either way, it's still super cute. Now, ooh, a bigger item. I might have to set that box down for a second. Okay, a bigger item this time. Let's see. Do, 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 do. An even better item. Look, under the same theme, a Mickey Mouse one. Look how cute that is. So, once again, kind of mask here type Mickey stuff. Um, lounge fly bag, which is super cute. I don't think I've ever seen this. Maybe this could be at box lunch. I don't know if this is parks, but. Oh, that's super cute. The pattern side's all just Mickey heads in it. As I show you the one that doesn't really have a lot of Mickey heads, but yeah, it's a whole bunch of Mickey heads in there. Look how cute that is. But that's super fun. Like, really good. You got 1928 on there. Just fun. Hey. It's like they could do a theme going on right here. You have that matching. But wait, even more. You can put this on the side. Like, they give you a whole, like, bag accessory. Like, who is ready for the holidays? Because this is super cute and was fantastic. Honestly, I don't even have more than to say that. I don't know if I would put the pin on it, but the rest of it is super cute, though. Oh, put the pin on the strap so when you're holding it, there you go. So overall, this was, I think, I think that's it. Maybe, hold on, let me check. We still have fall. We still had the little glittery things. It's still fall, there's a pumpkin. But it's a little curse to see here. But anyway, I think that's it. Let's go take a look at. So I believe that is it. So let's try and take a look at our lovely, you know, receipt list. No peeking. Let's see. We got the Mickey Mouse playing crazy bag, the keychain, the lounge fly zipper pouch. Okay, we got that the pin, and the candle. So, all right. So here's the prices of it because we always hear a good price range. So the lounge fly bag was $65. The Mickey Mouse keychain was $14.99. Um, the little pouch was $18. Um, the chain pin was $9.99. And then the wishes candle was 20. So overall, 127 98 127.98 not bad not bad at all i feel like this was like a really good choice like pick because this is super cute i like who wouldn't want to wear that that matches with any outfit and everything goes along with it besides the candle i think everything else works really well with it i think this was a really fun box so thank you guys for watching i sure hope you enjoyed the video because this was a really fun box i want I just want to get in there a box right now just to see what else is in it. Like, it's so fun. I don't know if you guys ever do unboxings, but it's so fun. Okay, so tell me what your favorite thing was in the comments. Was it the bag? Was it the candle? 
What was it? Because, hmm, hmm. If I had to choose my favorite, I think it's the bag. I keep bragging about the bag because look how cute that is. I think the, can the bag was my favorite. My least favorite, I would say is probably the candle just because it doesn't fit with the theme as well as I think everything else does. Because if they had like a Mickey Mouse candle, it would have been a perfect box. Like overall, everything would have been 100% in it. But overall, still great. Nothing, like it's not like I hate the candle or anything. So tell me what your favorite thing was. Was it the candle or was it the bag or was it any of the other items? And if you liked the video, Make sure to subscribe, and if you want to see more Disney content, I do have plenty of it, and also I do a whole bunch of other random stuff that is really fun. It's not just an unboxing channel, but I do enjoy a good unboxing every once in a while. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.